guys look at my new mug. I don't know if it's focusing, but I hope that it is. Oh my god, it kind of looks like a pea color, but it's not. It's green tea, I swear. I got this mug from one of my stream homies in chat. And it's a Stranger Things mug, and it's a hopper quote. So I'm gonna be sipping on this throughout the commentary. Thank you, thank you so much again. I miss Stranger Things. I miss Stranger Things so much, I can't wait for season four. If you guys didn't know, I did a Stranger Things commentary as in every single freaking episode that is out. So make sure you guys go check that out. Y'all will see my love for Stranger Things on there. Welcome back! What's up guys, it's Ange, and today we're gonna be watching another episode of Umbrella Academy. We are watching episode five already of Umbrella Academy. I'm still kind of lost in the sauce, and I don't know how anything connects. Though Leonard seems a little shady shady for throwing out Vanya's drugs. So, uh, I, I got my eye on him this episode. I wonder if more is gonna be revealed about that. And yeah, before we begin, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all of my content. I post three times a week. Follow me on all my social media. All my handles will be in the description below and follow me on Twitch. I live stream every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Sunday. Really cool things happen like uh, people gifting me mugs and also really fun gaming and slash uh, chatting and slash ukulele jam sessions. So please join us. Alrighty y'all, let's jump straight into the commentary. It's so hot. It's like 8 p.m. Like I chose to film at night today because I thought it was gonna be cooler. It is 8 p.m. and I'm sweating, sweating. Oh, finally, more about the apocalypse. I'm ready for this. Hi, Dolores. Oh, geez, this is so crazy. He's just wandering around, living life in the apocalypse. In the winters, too. Oh, must have been gruesome. He put a fuzzy hat on Dolores. That's so cute. Oh, yo, they show him aged, too. This is a cool sequence. Wow, I love this. And then even a few more years after that. Picked up a few cases of your favorite Bordeaux. Look at him. This is all, he has books all around here. So many things. He lived an entire life here. What? Does he hear someone? <gasps> what? Who? What? Huh? Umbrella Academy title card. And she was all in fancy clothes. Seemed like she tried time travel. She had the briefcase. Hold on, hold on. I need, to, I need to look at this. She has the briefcase. The briefcase. She's a time traveler. From what I could gather, we have four days left. Why didn't you say something sooner? Four days? Yeah. Why would... Uh, uh, uh. For the record, you already tried. Oh, damn. That's yeah. true. Yeah, but it, a warning would have been nice. When you were together, trying to stop whoever it was that the world this was clutched in your dead hand when i found you whose head like i said i don't know they're all robots and <gasps> Ooh. piece of shit get your ape hands off of me that sounds what you're he should about. be mad at klaus right he was in the middle of that shootout at gritty's and then oh yeah i guess it is number five none of which is any of your concern they just killed my friend oh poor diego losing everyone that he loves who are they five yeah, come on. You gotta spill the beans, dude. They work for my former employer. A woman called the Handler. And as soon as Diego's friend got in their way, fair game. And now they're my fair game. Oh, jeez. Okay, finally, we know who they are. They're the time-traveling people. They know what's going on with number five. Oh. Poor Diego. The receipt. Oh, I almost forgot about that. Donuts. A rookie mistake from Hazel. What's this really about, Five? And don't give me any of this. It's none of your business crap. Oh, well, it's a long story. Information, information, I need information, please. I'm here to help. You don't look like you're here to help. You 
you wouldn't hear the offer I'm about to make you. Oh, what? I work for an organization called the Commission. The Commission. We are tasked with the preservation of the time continuum through manipulation and removals. What the heck? When that happens, we dispatch one of our agents to eliminate the threat. You're a recruit. What? I've come to offer you a job, number five. Wait, this is so s crazy. That and your ability to jump through time. How does she know about him jumping through time? Once your contract is done, you can retire to the time and place of your choosing. Wanted to stop all of this from ever happening. Well, that's quite impossible, I'm afraid. What? Why? What? It's supposed to happen. Why is it supposed to happen? Hello? The end of everything? Not everything. Just the end of something. What does that mean? What something? I don't understand. So all so they basically make sure that all of what's happening in everyone's lives, like if my decision to make this cup of coffee instead of the other, if that somehow impacts the the timeline of freaking the world ending, then they kill me. The arrival of President John F. Kennedy. So I could get back. This is so crazy. I can stop the apocalypse. Dallas police. This is wild. So he ended up working for them, but then was like, psych, no, at the same time, so that he can buy time to be, and yeah. Oh, that's so cool. Some sort of temporal anomaly. Wait! Good job, Klaus. Yo! Dang, so he like double crossed them. That's crazy. They involved President Kennedy to kind of give like a little like, oh yeah, that's how President Kennedy died. Like, damn. Time changes everything. The planets in the <gasps> oh my gosh, poor Klaus. We love me like you love oh my god, his acting is so good. He just saw the world gone. Probably? But why are there blood why is there blood on his hands? Don't break it! What if it's useful? Oh my god, Klaus. Klaus is actor. So insanely good. That broke my heart. Oh, I forgot about these tubes. Violation code 6874A, unauthorized round trip travel, 1968. Explanation required. 1968? He didn't even see the future. He was crying about 1968. Is that why he had a dog tag? Was he in war? Is that why he had blood on his hands? That's definitely what happened. How do you know how to get back? That was still That's still probably traumatizing for Klaus. Oh God, Leonard. Hey, morning. Just kidding, Allison. Are you wearing makeup? Just a little. Oh, I love Allison's outfit. Flowers yesterday, brunch this morning. You really jumping in with both feet. Hey, uh, you were there, Allison, when she answered the phone and she was like, you wanna go get breakfast? I have a bad feeling. I haven't seen you in 12 years and all of a sudden you're giving me dating advice? I've been around long enough to note that when something seems too perfect, it's usually anything but. Like a woman who's based her whole life on rumors. <gasps> God! Oh, uh, Vanya! Sister Banter! We love it. Oh my god, I love how she's wearing like cute joggers with heel boots and like a coat robe looking thing. Oh, it looks cozy and chic all in one. I've been on this medication since I can't even remember. And I ran out yesterday and I feel great. If you feel better without it, then why bother even taking it? Oh, speaking of drugs, got you a cup of Allison came by earlier and bought me one. You two are spending a lot of quality time together, huh? Yeah, well, I mean, they are sisters, Leonard. Sisters. Oh, right, right. The uh, uh, whole umbrella thing. I forgot that. Yeah, don't try to be like, I forgot that. You definitely, like, studied her book. You're definitely, like, a crazy super fan or something, maybe. And you have, like, a vendetta against all of the Umbrella Academy. You want to be, like, savior complex to freaking... Vanya, t t t tell me that ain't true. You know, I don't think your sister likes me very much. No, no, it's... Did that not seem like a salt shaker? You did just put salt in your coffee. They're holding auditions for first year of my orchestra. What happened to the other girl? 
She just stopped showing up. That's great news. You get a chance to audition. She stopped showing up. You're telling me that stuck up girl stopped showing up to practice. All of a sudden, she was all about like, some people don't have it to Vanya. And the second after Vanya tells Leonard about it, she's gone. She disappears. Leonard is a creepy stalker person who wants Vanya's life to look up and wants to play savior complex. That's what it is. Leonard got rid of her. I don't know if it was like, you know, or if it was like, or if it was like, Money incentive? I don't know what it was, but Leonard definitely got rid of her. That's scary. That's insane. I just realized Klaus also must be hearing all the dead cries of the war people that A, he would have killed, B, his army mates, you know, his, his, his friends, that that's what he's probably feeling too and how much more traumatic that could be on, on him. Why is he all bloody? You know, I can recognize the symptoms, Klaus. Their symptoms? Well, it's when they broke into the house and they couldn't find you. They took me hostage instead. Oh no, everyone's gonna hate number five. Hey, how long were you gone? Almost a year. A year? <sighs> the hell were you thinking? What do you care? So I, I could get back. I can start over. Leave. Oh man. Oh, this is so complicated. I don't even know whose side to be on who to understand, who to not understand, like, their their feelings are valid, their situations are valid, like, how are they supposed to know any more or any less, and it's just so crazy that each individual person is going through their own little th thing, and it's, ugh, all equally as tense and emotional. I wonder if the dad dying was also from the commission. Is that what the group name? I forgot what the organization name was already. I think it's like the commission or something. Do you think the dad was killed? Okay, I okay. The dad was definitely killed by the commission. I, I, I have a good feeling. Cause something he's doing or was doing was hindering, it was gonna hinder the whole apocalypse thing. So they had to kill him, right? That's why he died unexpectedly. No one knows how he went. It makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Bless you. Thanks. Oh my god, they literally fought each other the other day. Okay, wait, what about him? What about him? What about him? What? Did she just find where he lives? Ooh, Allison's a little sneaky sneaky, yeah. Huh? You better figure it out in a hurry because I'm about to go on my lunch break. Oh, I could eat. Oh, did you just invite yourself to her lunch break? The heck? Oh. Maybe Diego is going to try to kill Hazel? Um, hey, just, just drop me off here. You sure you're okay, man? Klaus, where are you headed? He's got tattoos on his hands now, too. Not just the one. Oh, okay. He really just going for it. This episode is playing with my mind, and I don't know how to feel about it. <laughs> no. Oh, poor Klaus. This bar? It's for vets only. I am a vet. Where'd you serve? None of your business. Asshole! Whoa, 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 whoa. Call it a day. I'll go our own way. Oh, Diego trying to protect his brother. I'd like to apologize that you oh, God. are depriving some village of their idiot! Yo. Yo, that shot? And he's walking towards the camera? Oh, oh, it was so good. It was so intense. Damn, I should have called it that he was in the freaking picture. I'm a twitcher. I'm a twitcher. Was that like a drug thing? No, no, that's what we bird watchers call each oh. other. Link in the description below. Maybe even open up my own bakery and Aww. experiment with vegan donuts. <gasps> That's so cute. She's adorable. For the year or so, I will have saved enough to go. Hey, you might want to fast track your timeline. Oh God, he's talking about it. Hazel. You want something in life, you gotta go for it. Hazel is definitely torn. Hazel must be going through this huge like battle between his brain. He has killed so many people and he's also killing the rest of the world at the same time. Like his moral meter is definitely going haywire right now. 
Don't tell me everything is all right because I saw you in there. You were crying like a baby. Because I lost someone. Dave. The only person I've ever truly loved more than myself. Oh, and Diego knows exactly what that feels like. There he is. <gasps> oh, that zoom in. That's such a Hazel type of zoom in. I love it. Oh, another great shot. Wow, I love this episode's camera work. What is all this? Probability map of whose death could save the world. I've narrowed it down to four. If I had four days left before the apocalypse, I would have no assets. No freaking way of being able to stop it from happening or know how to do these probability map questions. I don't know about butterfly effects. I don't know anything about anything. I would be basically sitting around for four days trying to be like, what if we revisit the glass eye again, you know? I did not think he'd be dead in four days anyway. And let you go and kill innocent people for life, no matter how many lives you'll save. Luther! I mean, oh, this is a crazy- <gasps> Oh my gosh, Luther, you're relentless, but also- an <gasps> Oh my gosh, that literally scared me, even though I know that she's a mannequin and she won't actually get hurt, but like, damn. I know you're still a good person, Five, but you're not on your own anymore. Oh, God. There is one way. There was one way other than killing those people that you could have- It's just about impossible. Oh, just kidding. More impossible than what brought you back here. That is true. Five literally was about to just be like, bah, 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 on these people, these innocent people. Though, what would you do if you were in that position? If you knew the names of the four people that can lessen the possibility of the Earth dying, would you kill them? Let me know in the comments down below. Look, I know you're not going to hear this, but I was just in the library looking up Leonard. Why would you do that? Vanya, there are records of literally everything. But all I could find is a photo and his name in the phone book. It's like he didn't exist. You are unbelievable. And for the first time, someone thinks I'm special. Oh, Vanya. Oh, I totally understand what Vanya is feeling. But at the same time, she shouldn't just completely shut down her sister's advice. But I also just get it because Vanya has just gone through so much, especially with like being in the shadow of her sister. Now her coming back and just being like, I don't feel good about this guy, even though she's really, really happy, is, I get it. But at the same time, like, he is a creep. There's all the signs, man. He's weird. Well, he's the one we need to worry about right now. Why? Because he's in the parking lot hiding behind an ice cream truck. Bro. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. This is so intense. It's from five. <gasps> what? He says he has the briefcase wants to set up a meeting stay in the car i really wonder what would happen if you kill one of the commission people but i low-key don't want a hazel to die because i want to see where his story goes so what exactly is the plan here big guy i told you to wait in the car yeah you expect klaus to follow what you say <laughs> and they skirted Holy crap. Get in the car. They popped his tires. All right, well, now they're gonna go meet Five. What is Five even gonna do? He doesn't even have the briefcase. Well. Kill him. Kill him, Vanya. You got this. Oh, 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 she's going for it. Oh, she really just sneaking in. Ugh, oh, them using Vanya's audition piece as the soundtrack, like, behind the scene of Allison sneaking into Leonard's, I guess, old house, maybe, is pretty freaking cool. She's got powers! Right? Something like that? Please tell me she has some sort of powers and they were being suppressed by her drugs or something, maybe? I don't know! <gasps> oh god! Oh jeez! Leonard's house! I thought he had an apartment. Was I wrong? No, he did have an apartment. I didn't know if that was just for visual effect or impact. The whole waves and the notes and the thingies. That was just for, you know, just for effect. But that was maybe hint. Vanya has powers. I've lived a long life, but you're still a young man. You got your whole life ahead of you. That's so crazy. It must be weird hearing that from a kid, but it's so true. So where is a kid? Well, that's how you're gonna start a brother. It's not your average giant. It's true, he is now a beast. That's his briefcase to a pulp. Probably us too, right? So how do we help each other? You need to get in contact with your superior so I can have a chat with her. 
they're gonna have a conversation with the lady with the hair and the black coat. Are they like summoning her? <laughs> Diego! <laughs> Diego and Klaus! <laughs> Took the ice cream truck they were hiding behind! Oh god! Oh my god, that was amazing! I literally just died! Iconic moment! <laughs> ben! <gasps> oh god. Oh god. What just happened? Hello? Oh, look, he stepped in front of five. They just froze time. But this is really cool because it looks like a photo effect, which it probably was a photo and then they colored it, which is beautiful. It's like a greenish, bluish hue, orange hue to it, and I love it. Almost like a little bit of grain added to it as well. So why don't you tell me what you really want? Well, I want you to put a stop to it. What's meant to be is meant to be. What does meant to be mean? I'm but a oh God. small cog in a machine. I can't tell if there's an echo in her voice or they doubled it over, but whatever they did with her voice effect, it's pretty freaking cool. Come back to work for us again. You know it's where you belong. <gasps> what? They're offering him a job again? I'm talking about the home office. This is so weird. We're all looking for happy. Ugh, I love this freaking the scene. What about them? I want them to survive. All of them? Yes, all of them. I'll see what I can do. But you would take it and kill the rest of the world? No, no, do not deal. <gasps> he <laughs> what? They just, he just left with her. What's going on? What is going on? I don't even get it. I don't even understand. What? I'm literally just like, my brain is just exploding right now. I was speechless during that entire thing. He's gonna take it? He can't, because then what's gonna happen to the rest of the world? Unless he's mind manipulating them so he can get to the home office, so he can see what to do from there, because he only has like a few days left, so maybe he's not actually going to take the deal. But I also love that visually, that entire part. Even their faces weren't entirely focused. Like, something about that made it so picturesque. Like, stopped in time. Loved it. But also, ugh, wild. How'd it go? Oh god. Honestly? Yeah. Alright, maybe, is this his house? It was amazing. Oh, it is his house. What the heck? I kind of had a body experience. Yeah, sort of. And I got it. What? I got you this did? chair! Oh my Yay! God. But oh no, Leonard is so weird. You deserve this. Oh god, no, don't kiss him, don't kiss him, don't kiss him. Please don't kiss him. Anya, this is your time. Eh, I, I don't- I can't trust him! I can't! Please! No! What is this force? And how does he low-key know about it? So happy what is going on? <gasps> oh! Oh my god! 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 What? 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 That's Ben's body? But also, what I- and what is this force that's happening? Oh my gosh, this is insane! Ah! Oh! Huh? Is Pogo shady? How are you feeling? He brought mom back to life? Shady, 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 so shady. Do you remember what happened? I do. Shady. And you understand that the children can never- know. I knew it! I actually called it! I understand. Is Pogo freaking the bad guy? Please! Oh my god! I- I just need confirmation on everything that's happening right now! I can't breathe! I can't breathe! can't even I don't even know how to like oh oh
best episode yet. Like, seriously, best episode yet. That was so good from beginning to end. Everything was so fast-paced. Everything was so, like, intriguing. Klaus just spent time as... She's a veteran now. Pogo is shady, shady. Leonard is definitely shady. Ben is in his apartment. Uh, there's literally no way for me to know why people have the outs for Umbrella Academy, but I'm uh, guessing the commission has something to do with it as well. The commission was also like, let's see what I can do to keep your family alive, so maybe it has nothing to do with them, but I don't even know because one is already plotting against Vanya and Vanya is literally... <sighs> oh my god. I just need the next episode. 10 out of 10 episode, loved it. I especially love the camera work and the editing in this episode. It was just beautiful, so nicely done. There was like more times than not where I'm just like, <gasps> every time the camera switched an angle or did something, I was just like, I love that. I love it. I absolutely love it. This was the kick in my tuckus. I've been watching way too much Nanny to literally just want to binge everything right now, but I can't and I won't because I want to react to everything, but still, oh God. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this commentary, make sure you leave it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all of my content and don't forget to check out my last video. Alrighty, y'all have the best day ever and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, k bye, k bye, k bye. <laughs> Thank you.